shooting a little bit, you know, kind of get into the swing of things. You know, getting that edge up from everybody else that's coming in the summer, you know, I, I think it, it's, it's going to benefit me a lot. Why Tennessee? Um, you know, I'm a Tennessee guy. I was born and raised in the state of Tennessee. Been cheering for the Big Orange my whole life. And, you know, uh, I just couldn't see any other place for me to go. You know, that's, it's been my dream to run out of the team. Yeah, so I, I really can't. I really can't wait for that day. Justin played some of these were true freshmen this past year. Did that factor in your decision one way or the other at all, or was anything you paid much attention to? I mean, it did. You know, it's good to know that I could have a, be in a position to have early playing time. But at the same time, I think Tennessee was. I mean, they offered me two days later. I committed. It was. I knew this is where I wanted to be. I just like Jack. Describe your, your your skill set. What do you bring them to? You know, you're going to get a guy that uh, comes to work every day, and I like to say I play the game with a uh, physical edge. You know, I, I like to play nasty. You know, but um, I, I'm going to be smart. I'm going to know what I'm doing. But really, you should get a hard-working guy. What's the most important thing you want to get out of this semester? Um, you know, like I said, I just want to get into the swing of things. You know, I really want to get a lot stronger in the weight room. And, um, you know, I'll get a lot of work in with uh, the coaches and everything, just learning the new uh, plays and uh, just the new technique and all that. So, uh, but spring practice really will be a big, a big benefit as well, you know, because those, those practice days, they mean, they mean a lot in the development of the play. Have you talked to some of the older players at your position, and what has your interaction been like with the, the players that are already here? I've talked a lot with them. Uh, Coleman <laughs> Thomas, that's my big brother. And um, all really all the guys have just taken me in. And uh, yeah, they, they've been, done a real good job of that. And they're already kind of showing me the ropes a little bit. So uh, yeah, I'm very grateful for the great offensive line. Got all these guys, they're really good dudes. Well, Jack, even though you're in high school, you knew you are coming here, and, and the offensive line kind of just hits with all the sacks given up. I mean, even though you were in high school, knew you were coming here, is that something you listened to and you kind of took personally? You know, um, Tennessee's offensive line, they're, they're really young. And um, I, I really I really want to come up here and help any way I can. And I just want to be out there and do anything for Coach Mahoney, Coach Jones, any way they need me. Um, you know, I think this offensive line really making made a lot of strides this year, and they did a great job. Um, as the year develops, they just got better and better. And I hope to continue that into next year. We're just going to keep getting better and better. And if it means me getting to play a little bit, that's awesome. But I'm just, I'm here to work. And I'm um, hopefully I get to play early. But if I don't, it is what it is. But I'm having a mindset of like, I'm here to work. And I'm here to get this offensive line, this team better. You said it's a dream. Is that surrealness feeling? Is it still there? You know, you're wearing the colors. You're in this room. Is it, is it still fun in all? Yeah, this is all pretty surreal right now. You know, I've, I've, I've seen this, you know, being recruited, seeing guys getting more interviewed and stuff and now it's my it's my turn and um, it's pretty wild you know it's gonna but it, I, I really think it's gonna be a great experience um, I'm, I'm loving it so far um, just being able to come in here and train in this awesome facility it's been awesome uh, I can't I can't wait to uh, keep getting better but I know it's early but have the coaches given you stuff to work on already I mean what get in the weight room and then um, stuff on the field too well yeah I, I've, I've already been in meetings like I was in a 45 an hour meeting just now for uh, learning plays and everything. Oh, yeah, so um, yeah, it's it's we've already been working, and then I've been doing stuff on my own. It, it, it's been really great, you know, because like having this right here, this whole this big facility right here, you're able to come in whenever you want, get some work in. It just makes it easy to do that. And, um, so I, I really like that part. Of it. Jack, what kind of recruiter have you been within this class with other guys that have already committed and then other targets that are still out there? Um, you know, I've recruited a lot. Uh, Kyle Phillips, that was like, that was the guy right there that I really worked on. I spent a lot of time talking to Kyle because we, you know, we both worked with Info Motion and um, we've been going against each other since three sophomores, freshmen. So we're really, we were really tight. And, you know, it was more to me like, Kyle was really one of my close friends, so I was kind of like, I want you to do what's best for you. But what's best for you is to come to Tennessee, so why don't you go ahead and get up here? But I, I, I mean, I, I didn't know until like the Friday before he committed that he was coming here. He was messing around with me the night before, like saying stuff, and I was like, oh my gosh, you're terrible. But he came, I'm really excited about that, and everybody else, you know, we've got a great message going. We've been having that since. Uh, since everybody's been all committed, so um, just like really high. it's been really great to uh, get to know these guys and to kind of recruit some of these guys that come to them. Who's on that message? Uh,